Sweet but psycho, I think uh, that that creates quite a, a binary choice as well. Uh, you're either a nice person or you're a complete psycho. When I was going through my mental illnesses and I wanted to commit suicide, I was a woman crying out for help and I would actually hate to being called a psycho. I wasn't a psycho, I was a woman who was struggling. We're not talking about banning and all of those sorts of things. The lyrics and the imagery associated with the video very directly uh, connect the term psycho uh, with violence and violent behaviour. So what we want to do is get away from that terminology that causes people concerns, you know, mad, crazy, psycho, loony, all them things that are in general parlance. We want people to start thinking about what they say and how that might how that might make them feel when that sort of language is used quite openly. But one of the things I'd like to do is, is invite Ava, the next time she's in the UK, to, to come and talk to us. If she could use her talent to help sort of turn this around another way and create words and images and impact that actually brings to life in people's head the sort of importance of tackling mental illness, but in a really positive way. The importance of getting people to talk and therefore the importance of of taking this, this really, this really awful sort of phenomenon of, of suicide uh, out of our society. I think the, the term psycho um, really doesn't do anything for for people in in you know who've got mental health difficulties. It's a, almost a case of step back from somebody who's got a mental health issue because you don't know what they're going to do next. You don't know what frame of mind they're in and what they're capable of doing. Psycho, so let's push right.